the left, as we can see, has really serious positions for the future. They have really serious opinions and hopes and visions for the future of the U.S. Yeah. Um, serious enough that they're willing to organize into groups of hundreds and break things and burn things down. And we on the right, that gives us lots of time to talk about it and make fun of it and, you know, make compilations and whatnot. And what is our vision for the future? What are we willing yeah. to get that passionate it's about? It's a great Maybe question. So windows. three really basic yeah. things that I think should be a commitment to the next generation. It should be easy and celebrated to get married, have children, and be able to own property in this country. It should be a moral guarantee to the next generation to be able to do those three things. It's good for everybody. It anchors you in responsibility, right? Right now, it is harder than ever to buy a home in America, thanks to inflation and thanks to all this nonsense that's happening. We are telling young people not to get married, and we're saying that if you have children, it could be an existential threat to the climate. And we wonder why this is the most depressed, suicidal, anxious, alcohol-addicted, and medicated generation in history. Those three things should be a core social compact. I could, go, I could go through list by list, though, right? I want a country that cares more about our borders than the borders of a foreign country. I want a country that makes stuff that is critical to our national sovereignty and our future, such as vitamin C, penicillin. I want to see less kids addicted to pornography. I want to see more people outside. I want to see people spending less time on their phones. I think we should, we should entertain at least the spirit of a national week day of rest. I think we should have a day where we slow down. I think that we're able to get Uber Eats quicker than ever before. We're able to get medication we want. We have more ease and convenience that we're more miserable than ever before. Why don't we actually tolerate? We don't have to do laws, even though laws might be a good idea, where we just rest for a day. We used to call these blue laws, where everything kind of slows down. You spend time with loved ones. You don't look at the phone all day long. Maybe your favorite restaurant isn't open that day. Maybe you actually have to cook for yourself. I want that country. I want a country that actually is purposeful in our action, in our community, that is more local than it is corporate, that focuses more on the family than some abstract ideology. That's what I think we as conservatives need to fight for and fight for vigorously while they do all the nonsense that they do.